everyone, my name is Melissa Armo with the stocks. What should I thought it would review cost? Here you have an amazing chart and guess what happened? Cost gapped down today on earnings. Someone in the trading room mentioned that the earnings report was good. I don't read fundamentals. I just use my 26 point golden gap rating system to determine if the stock is a short or a long. In this case here, in the case of Costco, guess what? It was a short. And see, this is again why you can't really just make fundamental decisions because if you had looked at the earnings, if they were positive and stock gap down, you try to go long it, you lost money today. This was a short. Here's the chart of this. In fact, this actually gapped up last night, touched on a number which was far, far away from where it opened this morning. In fact, it was 170, let's just be exact. 170.50, okay, was where it touched last night. And then in the morning, by the time the stock opened, it had completely flipped, gapped down 100% and opened at 159. So it went from completely gapping up to completely gapping down. Anyways, this was a nice short today. Low of the day ended up being 156.54. Friday afternoon, beautiful, gorgeous day in New York City. Two o'clock in the afternoon, I can't see why anyone would want to be trading. However, cost worked this morning. That's what I'm usually watching in the morning is the morning gappers looking for the morning move. And here was the sell up and lit this just to go over it. You could have shorted it here, got the drop and got out. You could have shorted it here and held it, but you would have had to hold it into lunch. Uh, which is not always something that it makes sense to do. But in this case here today, actually, you could have made more if you held it down. Still a nice move in cost this morning. Great pick. Top watch today. Strong, solid week and a slow week. We have to continue to do that into the next week and into the end of the calendar year, 2017. Have a great day, everyone. And if you're interested in trading in the live trading room and doing my Golden Gap course, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. It's been a really, really strong year. And like I said, just gonna keep staying focused, doing everything in the morning, being prepared and focused, and that's the right things to do. Have a great day, everyone. Next Golden Gap class is October 14th and 15th. And have a great weekend.